It's Friday, April the 5th. Good morning. I'm Ian McLennan for Dan Blakely with your daily kickstart from Barry 360. Won't be an issue today, maybe not for months to come, but OPP out with a reminder to motorists to clear snow from your windows before heading onto the road so you have a clear view. A 39-year-old Barry man pulled over by the cops yesterday on Highway 400 at Maple View Drive due to the amount of snow that covered his windows, charged with having no clear view out his side and rear windows. A Wasaga Beach man facing 52 criminal charges in connection with alleged sex assaults of numerous youths over 20 years. Peel Region Police executed a search warrant last week and arrested the 68-year-old suspect. They say he's the owner of a Brampton boxing gym called King of the Ring. Charges include sexual assault, sexual interference, corrupting a minor, and making child pornography. Investigators believe there could be more victims. Well, this is going to be quite the rescue attempt. A seine net more than 270 meters long Long has been delivered to aid in the rescue of a killer whale calf stranded in a lagoon on Vancouver Island. The operation could happen early next week and could involve a crane, a specially outfitted truck and a landing craft or boat. A previous plan to airlift the two-year-old whale with a helicopter, well, that has been put on the back burner, at least for now. Israel has agreed to temporarily open a corridor in northern Gaza for aid deliveries. The move comes hours after U.S. President Joe Biden spoke to Israel's Prime Minister minister for the first time since an Israeli strike killed seven aid workers in Gaza on Monday, including a former Canadian soldier. Six inmates will be allowed to watch Monday's solar eclipse. The prisoners sued New York's Corrections Department over its decision to lock down prisons during the eclipse. Lawyers for the inmates said the cons reached a deal with the state that will allow the men to view the eclipse in accordance with their, quote, sincerely held religious beliefs. Oshawa generals rallied from a 3-1 third period deficit beat the Barry Colts 4-3 in overtime. The Generals lead the playoff series three games to one. They can wrap things up tonight on home ice. That's your kickstart for Friday, April the 5th. Back again tomorrow. Until then, remember, champions aren't built on the days they feel motivated, but the days they feel like quitting.